What's going on everybody? Another episode of 4 Before Can Begin Adventures. And uh, taking a little bit old school with this one, we're going to go back to doing a review on just something I bought today. It's an XTM 150 PSI air compressor. Um, as you would know, I had onboard air in the Triton and uh, I have not got any kind of air compressor in the Patrol until I install the airbag main kit, but um, that's not getting installed until I get the drawers in the back. So until then, I need something to pump my tires up on the beach. So I figured I would go down to BCF and buy uh, one of these 150 PSI air compressors. And at the same time, I might as well show you guys um, how long it takes to pump a tire. So let me go through the unit and then um, I'll pump some tires up and I'll show you something, or actually I'll show you something else cool in this video which is a new purchase that I bought, but I'm going to do a review on that a little bit later on, but I'll just show you in the video anyway, so you can uh, see what's going to come up. So uh, without further ado, let's get into it. All right, so here is the unit. I have actually um, unboxed it already, but I'll just take you through all the cool stuff that's in here. So obviously you get a big old hose, get him out of there. Get a big old hose, I think it's a nine meter. Little cap here to um, cover the gauge. And this is, the main unit. So, you get some cool features on this guy. So you get your standard, you know, alligator clips, that kind of stuff that go to the battery. And you do get a inline 60 amp fuse to uh, stop anything catching on fire, all that kind of cool stuff as well. Now, the unit actually looks like my old Ridge Rider air compressor, um, which I actually gave away to a mate because I got the airbag man kit and um, didn't think I need a compressor again. But uh, here we are. So it does actually look very similar. I'd say they're coming out of the same factory, probably these guys and thumpers. But um, that's everything you get in the box. Now, the only thing I can say I'm disappointed with is you don't get a bag. So I'm gonna sort of repurpose this box and use that as a um, carrying case, but you don't actually get a bag for it, which is a little bit disappointing. But, um, but you know, it's for 119 bucks this cost me, so I'm not complaining too much. But even the uh, real cheap thumpers, you've got a bag with those. So XTM or BCF, if you're watching, um, don't scrimp out in the bag because that's something that uh, really does make a difference when you want these rattling around the back of your car. Um, anyway, that's pretty much the unit, 150 PSI. Um, it has a 45 minute duty cycle of 40 PSI, but um, all, the, uh, all, the, all the specs are pretty much standard stuff. That you get with most of these units so nothing too fancy but um, as I said you do get a 60 amp inline filter sorry inline fuse which is pretty good because that's obviously a safety thing and the gauge looks like that nothing fancy pretty standard stuff so let's get this thing cranking I haven't even turned it on yet let's get it cranking chuck it on the tire and uh, see what it's all about so the first thing I'm actually going to do is show you what I bought the other day which is this guy here Interflate now, this allows you to um, pump up two tires at once, which is pretty cool. Uh, also lets you deflate two, uh, two tires at once and also pressurize two tires, which is um, pretty awesome. So I'm gonna use this for the first time as well um, because I haven't had a compressor yet, so I haven't had a chance to uh, use all this gear yet, but I'm gonna um, use this guy here to um, deflate the tire. So uh, I'm gonna hook him up and um, see what this thing's all about at the same time. So I might as well use it. Uh, while I'm doing this uh, air compressor video. So let's deflate this tire pretty much to zero or as close as and uh, then I'll time the uh, air compressor how long it takes to get the uh, tire back up to what 40 psi That's probably a good benchmark to go with and see how long it takes. So let's get into it So we've got them all hooked up. These are um, pretty much just clamps See on the gauge there it's picked up. Uh, what are we at? This is pretty much 40 psi and uh, to let the air out, you pretty much got to do this with one hand. Pull this guy down. And you start letting your air out. So let's get to uh, zero PSI. All right, we're pretty much almost there. Um, the interflate is saying 10 PSI, so almost there. But um, pretty cool little gadget this. I do actually quite like it. The fact that I can two let uh, two tires down at once, that's a, I mean, it's going to make my deflating a lot easier. Um, I'm just about to go do a video on the, um, like the first off-road trip in this car. So, um, you know, letting down tyres, pumping out tyres is going to be awesome with this thing. So, pretty, uh, pretty happy with that bit of kit. Worth the money anyway. So, um, so yeah, I'll get this down to where we're we at now. 
that 5 psi, get that down, and then I'm going to hook up the um, the XTM up to the uh, up to the tire and pump her up, do a bit of a time uh, time seg segment, see how she goes. But yeah, no, pretty happy with this um, interflate. Pretty awesome bit of kit. So I reckon that's probably enough. Where are we at? This thing's saying about 3 psi. That'll do. That'll do. All right. Let's hook up the uh, let's hook up the XTM. So hooking up the XTM now. So XTM all hooked up. All right. Um, pretty standard affair with these compressors. Positive, negative, all that kind of cool stuff. Actually, I hope that, um, this is the first time we would have seen the engine bay. I mean, seeing the big plastic thing that's in the engine bay. But uh, check out this beast. Big old V8. Got to be happy with that. All right, so chuck these on to positive and negative. And um, see what this is all about. Yep, beautiful. Clipped on there, clipped on there. Hopefully... Hopefully she turns on straight away. That'd be always a always a good thing. <laughs> Happy days. We have a working compressor. Let me go turn the car on actually. Oh, I'm gonna have a flat battery. Don't want that. Actually, you can hear a bit of a uh, startup. What do you reckon? Well, you might not hear it actually because I've got the um, the lab mic on, but. Um, She's all ready to rock and roll. My tire pressure sensor is having a full spastic at me because there's no air in this tire, as you can see. All right, let's pump them up. All right, so as you saw, 2 minutes and 21 seconds. Funny thing, I was, um, I'm still learning things about this car, but um, as I was pumping it up, the front right-hand side of tyre pressure obviously was having a moment because it was saying there's not enough pressure in there. But you can actually watch the PSI go up um, as you pump up the tyres, so I'll just show you. So you see on there, just here, saying 40 PSI. Bang on. Um, put the uh, interflate on it and said 40 psi with the interflate. Happy days. So, what was it? Two minutes and two minutes and 21 seconds? So, what's that? Um, let's go. It's four tyres. Just under, just under nine minutes. So, that's not too bad. So, it'd be interesting to see if uh, it takes four minutes and 42 seconds with the interflate doing two tyres at once. That'd be interesting. But I'll leave that for the interflate video, I reckon. I'll uh, do that test later on. So there you go. Those tyres reasonably quick. Um, two minutes and 21 seconds. Can't go wrong with that. For 119 bucks, um, longevity, no idea. I've literally just bought it, took it out of the box today for this video. So um, it should be interesting to see what the longevity's like. I've spoken to a couple of people because I put up a bit of a poll on Instagram um, they wanted to see this video, and a few, fair few people said they wanted to, so I was like, oh, I'll just make the video anyway. But um, a lot of people said these get really warm, so um, I'll test that along the way and uh, see if it gets really, really hot. But uh, first impressions, it's an air compressor, 150 psi, it's going to be reasonably quick, but um, yeah, 2 minutes, 21 seconds, done a pretty good job. So uh, yeah, I'll uh, try this out, I think, you know, try it out for the next couple of months, see how she goes before I put the airbags in the back and uh, go from there. But uh, I might see you in the next video. If I don't see you in the next video, I might see you in the tracks and trails. If I don't see you in the tracks and trails, I should see you later. Like and subscribe, all that cool stuff, and I'll see you later.